Taylor tell us more about this rainy Christmas? Well, it didn't look rainy at all in Morro Bay. You couldn't even tell. We have several storm systems on the way. This is our 8 5 webcam showing us a cloudless coast, which is what a lot of us saw across the area today. Our highs, though, still staying very chilly here. Nobody here breaking higher than the mid 60s. San Ynez 66, Santa Barbara 63, and us in San Luis Obispo at 65. We're going to keep it nice and cool even through our evening. Paso Robles, if you are headed to bed anytime soon, I just want you to be cautious. Take an extra blanket. 28 degrees is no joke. It's going to be very, very cold overnight in those interior valleys. San Luis Obispo sitting at 41 tonight. Santa Maria 38. Lompoc very close at 39. And even over in Santa Barbara, a very chilly 43. Now our satellite and radar showing us the Pacific Northwest getting hammered with some rain and some snow in there. But this system building out on the coast actually going to be a couple that are going to be coming in is going to swing its way in to the central coast starting on Tuesday. The timing of that is going to be a little bit tricky, so we will try and break it down in just one second. But looking ahead to those interior valleys tomorrow, Looking very similar to what we saw today. A couple of clouds in the morning, a couple of clouds at night, but majority of us going to be seeing clear skies. Going to be a little bit cooler though, not breaking out of these 50s in the coastal valleys. Same with West Beaches. 57 is going to be that high, and you can see a few more uh, clouds there on the coastline. South Coast though, looking nice until around 5 o'clock. We'll see some clouds inching our way in. Those clouds going to be more widespread as we head into Monday, but as you can see, Sunday night starting to creep in here, especially on the coast in Santa Maria heading into Monday afternoon. You'll see it kind of take over the entire forecast area here. And then as we head into Monday night into Tuesday is when you'll see that rain start to form. This model is not going to be long enough for us, us to see what's going on past Monday night into Tuesday. But you can see a little tiny little bit in the corner there. That is the rain that we will be seeing. This weather model here we can see as we head into Sunday, we'll see those clouds rolling in Monday into Tuesday. This is the system that is going to swirl into the central coast. Majority going to be happening Tuesday night into Wednesday if these models stay correct. And then another system, which of course this one is not going to show us begin again. It's too far out, but pretty much this second round of rain is going to hit us Thursday into Friday. So that's two separate systems. The first one bringing about an inch to two inches of rain, mainly in the coast to the valleys. Higher elevations could get hammered with some snow, especially on Thursday. Now that second system going to be bringing in less rain than the first one, about a half an inch around the area. Now tomorrow though, Paso Robles is going to be at 57. Those overnight lows, very chilly, 57 in Santa Maria and 58 in Lompoc. Morro Bay 57, Cayucas 55 in Cambria in those mid 50s also. Swinging on down to Pomo, looking at 57, and same with the Royal Grande, Pismo Beach, Los Osos, and Guadalupe, and Shandon all tapping out at 57 for our Sunday afternoon. Goleta 57, San Ynez 59, and Los Alamos 60. And that seven day forecast, see it one more time Tuesday, Wednesday, that inch of rain. Thursday, Friday, going to be that half inch of rain. And then lingering into your Christmas as well. So, like I was saying, we're going to have not a white Christmas, but most likely a wet Christmas. All right, Ayrton, take it away.